What's up guys and welcome back to another episode here on NRV Outdoors. Today we're here at the old trophy trail stream to do a little bit of review on a new product that I've seen at Walmart and that is the Ozark Trail Trout Fishing 50 piece kit. Right here we got a little cheap 50 piece beginner trout fishing kit that Walmart's selling for between the $5 and $10 range. It's super cost effective and it'll get you started trout fishing for a really good price. So let's go ahead and hop in this box here guys. Let's see what comes in this 50 piece kit and we'll see what we can do to catch the fish on every bait in this box. Alright guys, there we go. Now as you can see right off the go, we've got ourselves some trout worms. And it looks like down here we've got some helgramites in black, brown. We've got some little curly-tailed white grubs in there. That's pretty awesome. And here on the right side, we've kind of got some small little crawl pinchers, some in orange and green, some in orange. Yeah, they look like they're all crawl pinchers throughout on this side. Then we've got some little jig head hooks, some small little J hooks, a few weights, and a float in there. So let's go ahead and hop in here, guys. We'll grab out our first bait. We'll fish around a little bit this morning, and we'll see if this little 50-piece trout kit We'll actually catch you some fish. Stick around, guys, and let's have some fun. Let's go ahead and pop this little plastic container open here. Oh, it looks like instead of a curly tail, that was actually a small little white nymph there, or like a small little fly. That's pretty awesome, actually. But from what I'm seeing right off the get-go, it's just a small little red and white float. Some kind of oversized weights here. Pretty good-sized weights. We've got some jig head hooks, just like that. Then we've got some just straight J hooks, some really long straight J's. See if I can grab one out of here. Fingers are super cold this morning. We've got about 32 degrees air temperatures this morning. But there you go, guys. Just a small little J hook in there. So I'm thinking we'll go with just the one thing that we know works year round. We'll knock out the easiest bait first, and that would have to be the pink trout worm. We're going to rig that up on our little J hook here, and we'll probably add ourselves even our little float. So we'll go ahead and get this rigged up. And as soon as we get it rigged up, I'll catch back with you guys. I'll show you the rigging and we'll start doing some fishing. So we're all rigged up here. We're going to start off with that pink worm, like we said, and that big gigantic J hook. Now we're going to try wacky rigging and this hook may be too big and just too bulky for the fish to really want to come in and bite it. But we're going to try wacky rigging in it first. And about two and a half foot away up there is our little red and white indicator there or a little bobber as a lot of you guys call it. And we've just got our simple little loose mock pearl combo here, spooled up with some fresh eight pound 100% fluorocarbon. We're just going to cast this little wacky rig J hook around, see if we can trick one of these big trout into biting. And if we can't, we'll manipulate the presentation until we eventually can trick one of these fish. So let's get in here, guys, and let's get started. There we go, guys. First fish of the morning right there on the old pink worm. Pretty typical trout bait. And the Ozark Trail version seems to work just as well. And again, that old J-hook seemed to work out for us. Didn't need to do any special rigging to trick this little beautiful girl here into feeding for us. It's a small little rainbow to start off the morning here. Let's get her unpegged. Super sharp hook. There we go. And we'll just let her swim off right here in front of us. Take off little girl. There she goes, slow and methodically back into the creek. But there's our first bait down, guys. That little pink worm on that J hook. Let's go ahead and hop in here. We'll grab out our next bait. We'll kind of see what's in the box and we'll see what we're going to use next. So go ahead and stick around, guys, and let's see what's next. All right, guys, now there are several colors of trout worms in this particular little package, but I don't want to use all of them, mainly because I've got a plan for this particular box of baits. So what I want to do next, guys, is I've seen in the very back side of this is some small little helgramite baits. Now this is just this little black helgramite looking bait that mimics a whole lot of baits that are in the creek. And I really think this big long J hook will work well. That's why I wanted to use this particular bait here next. So let's go ahead and get it rigged up. And all I want to do with this is, as you can see here, it's got some eyes on top to kind of give it a lifelike look. So we're going to grab our J hook just like that and start at the head. We're going to work our way all the way down this little soft plastic here. Just like so. Again, my fingers are just completely frozen this morning. We'll just run him out just like that right there. Run him all the way up the hook till his head pops out just like that right there guys and that's a nice little helger mite presentation we'll just drop it in the creek here to see if it'll sink 
it does very, very slowly sink. So we'll go on ahead and make our first cast in here, guys. And we'll try our little black helger mite out of our Ozark Trail Walmart trout fishing kit. Oh, there we go, guys. Heck yeah. That fish absolutely crushed that old Helger mite. Wow. Heck yeah, guys. So, so far, so good on the old Ozark Trail baits. They are absolutely slaying the fish this morning. This little beauty here came over and, I mean, literally popped the bobber. She hit it so hard. I mean, it made a little popping sound like an old popper for a bass. She just absolutely crushed it. Let's see if we can just swing her right on into the net another gorgeous little guy here not super big we'll go on ahead and save our fingers though guys we will grab out our hemostats here pinch a shank of the hook we'll turn that out just like so fingers are super cold this morning but there you go guys fish number two on the old ozark trail kit and that one was on that old black helger mite as you can see right there i mean just an awesome little bait and that fish absolutely crushed it so let's go ahead and let her go right here in the creek don't want to keep her out too long let her take off there she goes back strong right there, guys. Heck yeah. So, so far, that's two baits down pretty quickly. So, we'll go on ahead and pop off our little Helger mite here. Just get her unrigged just like that. We'll go on ahead and pop open our little Ozark Trail kit here. Now, I'm thinking to complete this side over here, we've got two different types of nymphs. We've got black ones, we've got white ones. I want to go on ahead and go bright and just try out that little white one there. And that will complete this one here. And all that's in this side again, guys, is the Helger mites in black and brown. And these little nymph looking flies in gray and white here. So we'll go on ahead and get this little white one here all rigged up. This bait does feel like it's gonna be a floating bait, but I could very well be wrong. So we'll get it rigged up first here to find out. Same thing as that Helger mite though, guys. We're gonna start from the head. Bury our hook right into this plastic. Again, excuse the speed and the straightness. My fingers are completely, completely frozen this morning. So we'll rig him up there just like that. I got to admit, guys, that's a pretty good looking little trout bait right there. So let's see if it'll sink or float. First thing that we need to know. It does sink just like the other counterparts. So we'll go ahead and just bomb it out here, guys, and we'll see what happens. All right, guys, we've got our little jig all rigged up here. Just got him ran up all the way to the head there. Nice inline look. Got a simple little fisherman's knot there. So let's just cast this guy in and we'll jig it around the bottom. We'll introduce it to as many fish as we can and we'll see if we can catch a few. But so far this morning, I haven't actually physically seen any fish using my glasses. So we'll just blind cast around, see if we can call one out of these little grass patches here and just see what happens. If need be, guys, we will switch over to that old gray color. But as of right now, let's just toss around this white one. We've got him all rigged up and ready to go. And let's just see what happens. There we go. Oh, he popped off. Oh, no. We had him for just a second there, guys. Had him for just a second, and he threw the hook on that old white grub there took a little bit of jigging but i've seen that one just come over and absolutely charge it i don't know if we'll be able to trick that fish into ever doing that again but i suppose we could try there we go there we go there we go heck yeah oh this fish is angry guys we popped off two fish on this bait caught one fish off camera but we got one in the net for you guys here just to complete this challenge on video for you guys not a super big one but a really beautiful fish right there heck yeah let's just let her take off right here don't want to keep her out leave her in there nice and healthy heck yeah guys and again that was on that little white nymph looking creature bait so we'll go on ahead and pop him back into our little box right here now when it comes to crawl pinchers guys I really do like green. So we'll go on ahead and go with this beautiful little green crawl pincher here to end out our video.
Got him on. Oh, big one too, guys. Big old nice one. He came over and crushed that old crawl pincher. Heck yeah. Dark colored fish. Big old angry one, guys. Big old angry one. Came over and absolutely crushed that old crawl pincher. Heck yeah. Oh, calm down, girl. Oh, she's going to beat herself over here. Let's just turn her. Slide her right on into the net just like that. Heck yeah, guys. Calm down, girl. We're going to get you off. And we're going to set you back in the creek. Happy and healthy. There we go. Got her popped off. Let's just let her take off right here while she's still good and strong. Take off, little girl. There she goes, right on back into the creek. Heck yeah, guys. Now, I would like to mention that if you want a chance to win this entire box of really epic little baits that we have tested and proven to work really well today, just simply head down there into the comments, guys. Drop me a comment. Any comment will do. And make sure you're subscribed and you have that uh, notification bell on because if you don't get my videos, you won't know whether or not you won. And if you can't know you won, well, you can't claim your prize. So, guys, go ahead, head down there, drop me that comment. And uh, in a couple weeks, I'll pick a winner and I'll ship this entire little package of baits out to you. But until next time, boys and girls, get out if you can and do some fishing. But most importantly, be safe and tight lines.